Today I'm going to talk about pulling your dreads back or always having them in like a ponytail or pulled back with a headband. So I know a lot of people in the early stages of dreads when you know the dreads are a little crazier, a little more chaotic, it, having them pulled back makes them seem a little more tame so a lot more people are comfortable with that. But an issue I see with that is you know, when you do something to your hair for a long time, it becomes trained that, that way. So that's why like, you, can, you can train it to do certain things but for a period of time, continue to do that. And so if you always have your dreads pulled back in a ponytail or always pulled back with a headband of some sort, they're going to get trained in that position and trained to be pulled back. So a friend of mine here at school, he, he also started with shorter dreads. So longer dreads have more weight, so it might be different. But um, he always had them pulled back with a headband. And so anytime he took the headband out, his dreads would just go, stick straight out right here. Um, they wouldn't lay flat because they're always pulled back. So that's something I don't recommend is always having it pulled back because that limits you. Then you can only ever have it pulled back. And so if that's something you want, that's fine. But I think it's good to have, be able to have a little versatility with your dreads and the styles you're going to pull off. So I don't recommend always having them pulled back. Um, you know, if you are in those early stages and you feel more comfortable having them pulled back, you like that appearance at, at that time more before they're, you know, more matured. And that's fine, like when you're in public to have them pulled back and stuff. But I recommend when you get home or you're at some point when you are, you know, by yourself or whatever, to pull them out, like, you know, take the hairband out or whatever and let them just hang down and get used to that so that way they're not only trained to this position. So, I mean, no problem with ponytails. You know, I'm rocking one right now. Um, but I think there's a problem when that's the only style we can do. So, something to keep in mind as you're starting your dreads or even when they're later on in the process, you know, I just don't think you should always have a ponytail or always have them pulled back. I think it's fun. And, and, I mean, that's half the fun of dreads is trying out the different styles and different things you can do with it. I mean, the other day a friend of mine was over here and she like French braided mine. And I was like, all right, this is pretty nuts, but it's cool. You know, there's a lot of different things you can do with dreads, especially once you start getting some length. So, so do that. Don't set yourself in, like, don't be set in stone in one style. Try out different things.